Spider-Man, Spider-Man, you can't catch him, Spider-Man. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, he's a spider and you ain't <laughs> Spider-Man. Guys, I don't think that's how the jingle goes. But it is how the jingle should go, so. Hello, Troublemakers, welcome into another Movie Commentary Monday. I wasn't sure what I was going to, to watch today for a commentary, so I decided to open up Netflix. I have in my list a number of... <laughs> Hold on, let me... <laughs> let me explain. <laughs> I don't, you guys shouldn't be seeing this, all right? You shouldn't know that I'm gonna watch Unicorn Academy, okay? You don't need to know that information. But when I went open up my Netflix, guess what flashed in front of my face? Spider-Man Across the Universe, number one in movies today. I thought, wow, what a topical movie for me to cover. It's kind of like perfect. I feel like you guys would want to see that. I kind of want to watch it. But then I started to think, wouldn't it be funny? As soon as that phrase enters my brain, anytime I think something, I always have to do the thing. I thought, wouldn't it be funny if instead of covering the topical Spider-Man at the moment, what if I covered the one from 10 years ago that is probably like the least talked about? But the one that everyone adores. Every time I hear people talking about the uh, the Andrew Garfield Spider-Man, people rave about it. And I figured since I've never seen it before, it would make a great commentary. If you guys, we can watch Unicorn Academy. Like, I'll, I'm willing to dive in if you guys wanna. You guys wanna? No? You don't wanna? Okay. Where is it? Spider-Man. The amazing Spider-Man. My apologies. He's not just Spider-Man. He's pretty freaking amazing too. I watched the original trilogy with Tobey Maguire, and then I, I've seen almost all the Tom Holland ones, except the first one, ironically enough. But not these two ones in the middle. Since we haven't seen this movie, should we just make some predictions? My guess is, uh, I think the Garf is is gonna get spider powers. No, I'm excited. I, I don't, I think this one did, uh, instead of Mary Jane, they did, uh, Gwen Stacy. Four. Uh-oh. Little hide-and-seek boy, looking for your dead uncle. Not <laughs> that would be a fun way to change it up. He's not finding out his uncle died. He's like, hide-and-seek, where are you, my family? Uncle, where are you? Oh, wait, you died again. I forgot. <laughs> You're not here, I come. Uncle, you in here? Goes up to a... A bowl of ashes. <laughs> nope, Mr. X. Told ya. <laughs> oh, it's his dad. Oh, wait. Oh, his parents were studiers? That's the professional term for researchers, is studiers. Evil. I I saw him from afar. That man's evil. He's evil. Alright, uh, evil. Evil man right here. You're gonna stay with that man, Uncle Ben, for a little while. Oh wait, that's his uncle. That's Uncle Ben. Okay. <laughs> so far, I have not been doing well in my predictions. I'm gonna go with you. He can't take you with him. He just doesn't love you enough. That's why he's dropping you off. He could take you with him. He just doesn't want to. Be good. Yeah, be good. Yep. Not even a take care. Is this on Disney? I gotta watch this on Disney because Netflix, like the quality, after like five minutes, it'll go from HD to like 480. And as much as I hate the controls for Disney. Wait, the pause button works? As much as I normally hate the controls for Disney, at least it stays in HD. Netflix, get your stuff together. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? You know what? My most recent function was the full screen, and then I hit the space bar, and it unfull screened. So maybe that is on me a little bit. It's more on the UI, but that's a little on me. Play, and now, that's the most recent press. Okay. Okay, okay, where were we now? Oh yeah, your father didn't love you. <laughs> you grew up rough, huh? Peter, right? Listen, are, are you busy Friday night? Oh, wait, what? He's getting action? This better be a prank. You better be bullied. How can I cheer for you if you're not even getting bullied? Well, I guess you, your parents bullied you by abandoning you. <laughs> I'll allow that then. You can get a date. Can you take pictures of my boyfriend's car? Oh, <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. It's not a prank, it was a misdirect. Oh, cr uh, ooh. I don't like that. I don't know why I don't like that. I like a school photographer. He can take photos of whatever he wants, but when you know he has a vested interest in somebody, it just feels a little gross. Ooh, what are you gonna do with that photo later, huh? You gonna look at it, you gonna kiss it? Parker, don't be even. <laughs> He's a bad guy. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta buy a new chair, man. I had to like hump my chair in order to get the backrest to like change positions. Don't get me wrong, I kind of like it sometimes, but not all the time. <laughs> that is a little weird. That's weird. If this is gonna be about Peter's dad, I feel like he should have been a little bit more of an important part of that beginning story. Yeah. And now Disney's pissing me off because I have to hit the space bar three times every time I want it to do the function. So once, okay, don't. Now you make me look stupid. See, I hit it once there. 
It didn't stop. Three times. You thought you could make me look stupid, Disney, huh? Joke's on you. I could do that all by myself. <laughs> Kurt Connors. They worked together for years, and they were close. Dr. Connors. I think that's Lizard Man. She's pretty. Thanks. I'd like to secretly take photos of her. Hey. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how I felt about that. There was a shot before. It had a very Harry Potter feel. It's this, it's this like, dark basement, but it doesn't feel like... Creepy dark. It's a shot of the stairs here, and then the garf kind of slowly leans into frame. And it's got, it's got this, I don't know, this, this feels very Harry Potter. This, however, here. Magnify the photo, and then it goes into the video of it. I don't know, I like the Harry Potter shot. I did not like the photo on the internet becomes real life transition. I'm Stacy, I'm a senior at Midtown Science, and I'm also head intern to Dr. Connors. So I'll be with you for the duration of your visit. She's the head intern? at like the corporate facility for one of the largest tech companies in the world, I assume this is. As a, what, she's a fucking junior in high school? There, hey, no, you ain't no lead nothing. Welcome, my name is Dr. Curtis Connors. Curtis Connors? Man, what are you doing in this lab? Shouldn't you be making YouTube videos? If you can somehow give this ability to the woman you're talking about, that's that. Okay, that's... Uh, <laughs> okay. Ooh, call yourself Dylan. So I'll leave you in the more than capable hands of Miss Stacy. The high school junior. <laughs> Who's the head of interns? How are you doing, Rodrigo? Are you following me? No, I'm not following. No, I'm not. Guys, I'm gonna take you to the bioreactor room now. <laughs> the bioreactor room? I'm 16. Let's go to the bioreactor room. I'm gonna lead a bunch of children into a bioreactor room. What could go wrong as a teenager? Sorry. Yo. <laughs> that man is weird. I hope Spider-Man kills him. Go get him, Garf. Oh, he is not one for espionage, huh? Oh my god. Oh my god! Look at that technology! And a high school junior. I uh, shut up. Shut up. You're not convincing me this. <laughs> there is no way. <laughs> oh my god. Espionage? Oh, is this where he gets bitten? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, there it is! Well, uh, there's a bunch of them. Okay. One of them is gonna get you, bitch. Oh. Why would he go, Why would he come in here? You said you were close. We are. Norman Osborne is dying, Dr. Connors. Ooh. Save him. Ooh. We both lose our heads. Ah, ah, You gotta kill everyone here, right? They've seen, they've seen too much. Disgusting. Now I smell like beer. Now I smell like beer, bitch. You just watched a guy jump to the ceiling and hang there. I think there are bigger issues afoot, right? I'd be like, hey, you're a vampire, right? Great. Now I smell like beer. Like that's the biggest problem you have. There's a fucking vampire on the train. Like, I didn't... Get your hand off her. Guys, he was just on the ceiling. Oh, oh, sorry. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What? The... <gasps> Fly, Peter. <laughs> Why would you deliver the line like that? That's a fly, Peter. Let me hear that again. This is Sally Fields, right? Is her name Sally Fields? Sally Field? Oh, she's just a single field? She's not even multiple fields. Two Academy Awards, two Golden Globes. Okay, so she's pretty decorated. That's a fly, Peter. That's a fly, Peter. <laughs> what am I watching? <laughs> It's gross as hell. Watch this, watch this. I don't, I don't, ooh, that felt too CG. Okay, okay, okay. Well, thanks to this little escapade of yours, I had to change shifts at work, so you have to pick up Aunt May tonight at 9 o'clock. She looks familiar. She's the girl on your computer. Oh! You're killing me, Gramps. Or Uncle. Like, you can't say that out loud, my guy. She's your screensaver? Homie, you've had 
two conversations with her. On the second conversation, her first question to you was, are you stalking me? <laughs> and now you have her on the screensaver, dog. Oh, his voice echoed too. Like you're in a, a near empty hallway. There's like no carpeting. There's a lot of hard surfaces. So his voice is bouncing around. His voice went bonk, bonk, bonk into that ear. I heard, I know she heard that. Yeah, he's got you on his computer. Oh, you're killing. Oh my God. No. Oh my God. I would kill myself. I would transfer schools. <laughs> I swear to God. Man, you don't have me on your computer. I took a photo of the debate team and you're in the debate team, so. Right. Oh, oh, hey, that's a decent save. But why is the debate team photo your, your screensaver? You got more questions to answer. You need more information. I would avoid this man. Um, I, I was touching up stuff. You're touching up stuff? Oh, oh, hey, that's funny. I'm not gonna answer that. <laughs> oh, hey, this is safe. This is cute. Look at these two. Oh my God. He got a date out of that. <laughs> This has got like a very indie feel to it. This one feels less commercial than certainly the newer ones. Like this feels very era defined. I don't know if that makes sense. I'm sure it makes sense because I think that's the reason why people like it so much. I've seen that before. The Ganali device. Load it with an antigen, it creates a cloud which can be dispersed over a neighborhood, even an entire city. It's incredible. Well, this is the final villain, the vice. I bet. Look at that shot, look at that shot, that push in. No, what if the device were loaded with a toxin? What if you wanted to opt out? You can't run away from the cloud after. There you go. The final villain device is gonna have to shut it down before it gasses the city. You need to take that. Oh, he's supposed to pick up Aunt May. Preempt the protein. He's supposed to pick up Aunt May. Oh my God. So is this gonna be like a butterfly effect where Uncle Ben instead leaves work at a different time to pick her up, takes a different route or something because of this and then he dies? Oh my God. Oh, you were supposed to pick up Aunt May. Oh, no one's home. Didn't you forget something? He's alive? What the fuck? Your aunt, my wife, had to walk 12 blocks alone in the middle of the night. You will pocket. not defend this. I'm... You're a lot like your father. You really are, Peter, and that's a good thing. What, because you abandoned your family? <laughs> he abandoned her to walk 12 blocks, get it? You had a moral obligation to do those things. Responsibility. Where's my dad? He didn't think it was his responsibility to be here to tell me this himself. Oh, and how dare you? How dare I? How dare you? Ooh! You gonna turn this around into a reverse card? My dad abandoned me? You can hey, Peter, you can only play this a couple of times. Are you sure you want to use this to get out of this trouble? This is pretty light trouble. I might save this. Then again, he's probably been saving it for a decade and he's like just raring to use it. Or maybe he's not a sociopath, it's just how he feels. <laughs> here, please. Oh, he gonna go out looking for him. Oh, I, yeah, I'm not, you know what? I'm gonna stop predicting how he's gonna die. Cause I thought I had it. I thought I nailed it. I was feeling pretty good about it, but um, I guess maybe I should have seen it coming cause we didn't do the uh, the great responsibility comes with great uh, territory or something. What is, what is it? The great power comes great responsibility. That's what it is. Yep, he's out looking for Pete. Oh, villain, villain. He's wearing sunglasses at night. He's a villain. Also, he's wearing one of those dumb coats without sleeves. The villain. But daddy didn't give you enough milk money today? Step aside, kid. <laughs> <laughs> T-Bone. With a name like T-Bone, you expect to get tricked. It's your fault for hiring a T-Bone. Somebody stop that guy! Stop that dude! It's a six-pack, my guy. You're not chasing him down the street for a six-pack. Hey! <laughs> oh my god. Why would you lunge at somebody running away with a gun? It was a poor choice, Ben. I'm sorry, you had to go. Oh, this this sketch artist is gonna this is gonna be great. I want to see the photo. It's funny with the glasses and. <laughs> can I can I have that? Sure. There's one other thing. <laughs> <laughs> when you draw a wanted poster, do you draw the guy with sunglasses? Cause he he would just like. Boop, not wearing them anymore. I guess if you don't have the information, you know what his eyes look like. You don't want to draw his eyes, but it just feels weird to draw a suspect with sunglasses. You do have to think from from. <laughs> sorry, sorry. You do have to think from Peter Parker's perspective, though. He did, like his uncle just died and it was because of this man. However, I don't want this to be overlooked. This man also did give Peter a free chocolate milk. So he's not like the worst person in the world, right? He's giving free milk to the kids. Oh my God, did you hear about Peter? His uncle died. Yeah, but I heard he got some free milk though. So it kind of balances out. To understand all industrial applications. You notice that with the music? Nice little touch. Hey, I'm a eggs, organic, got it. Damn, he still hasn't found the killer yet. Just let me go. Is that a knife? Uh, that okay. nice. yes. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. Just let me go. Is that a knife? <laughs> Real knife. My weakness. It's small knives. Just let me go. 
That's the funniest thing I've ever seen in a Spider-Man movie. That is so good. Stop, get off, man. No. <laughs> oh, oh. 38 of New York's finest versus one guy in a unitard. I'm sorry. Let me reframe my brain. Because that, that line delivery was so corny and actory. Let me reframe my brain in, like, nostalgia. I know I'm watching a movie. The corniness lends to the enjoyability. Let me reframe my brain for a moment. Okay, I got it. Let's watch this line delivery again. Oh, 38 of New York's finest versus one guy in a unitard. Okay, yeah, it's fun. It's fun. You gotta look through that lens, though. Did you get the eggs? I'm gonna get enough. No, you most certainly will not. Here's my guess. This man, who was like, hey, Norman's gonna have both of our heads rolling if we don't get going on this research. So now he's gonna threaten, like, hey, good, we've seen progress, but we need to see more progress and fast. Otherwise, your head is gonna roll. And he's gonna be like, oh, crap. And he's gonna inject himself. And then he's gonna kill this man. Not right now, but later. You have to start human trials. No, I won't. I'm shutting you down. Have your office cleared out by the March. Okay, so the pressure has been applied. He doesn't want to lose his research, so now he's going to inject himself. Oh, that's cool. I like that. <clears throat> no, they're beautiful. I'm sorry. They actually held together very well. I'm going to keep these. <laughs> I, I, I'm a little disappointed. I haven't figured out how to work in. Sometimes I hit, have jokes hit me before I start watching movies and I'm like, I can't wait to work this one in. And uh, before I started shooting today, I was hoping that she would be doing some schoolwork and then she would teach Peter something. And then I'd say something like, if Emma Stone is teaching you a subject and you had to take a, a class on it, I bet you end up with an easy A because she's such a good tutor. It would have been funny. I'm just saying that would have been funny, right? Like right now you're like, Egh. Dylan, but like I'm just saying like I know it would have been funny if I had found a way to work it in But I don't the opportunity hasn't come yet, and I and I feel like I just got to unload this shot That's um, hey, that was... oh He's the police. Oh, how did I not see this coming? <laughs> of course. Oh my god, your arms back. Oh, but it's reptilian. Oh My god, that's gross. I'd rather have a nub what is that? What is that? Oh, you're gonna peel it? You're gonna peel it? Gross. Look at that. Look at that hand hatch. Oh, that's fucking gross. Oh my god. Quit peeling it. Oh my god. Look at that embryo hand. That's gross as hell. What are you doing? Oh, uh, I don't know. Why are they so rich? He's the chief. He's a police officer? What does she do? Dad, did you catch that spider guy yet? Yeah. Oh, look at this. This is a New York apartment. Why do they have so much money? Is this their own private balcony too? What happened to your face? I want to tell you something. Oh. I've been bitten. What? Fine. I'm sorry, did you just say so am I? I ain't no way I just heard that. What did you say, Stone? So am I. Ah! Okay! Okay, 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 okay. Well, okay, wait, no, 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 no. What, is, what does she mean? Can you ask her what she means, please? I don't care about you telling her this thing. I was kind of like, I hope he does her. But now I don't care. Now I just want to know what she meant. Like, if he said I was shot, and then she was like, yeah, so have I, by a cupid or something, I can understand that. <laughs> I've been bitten. She's like, yeah, me too. What is that? What are you talking about, Stone? I, I wish I could just... I can't. It's hard to say. Just say. Oh, my God. Look how close she is, Peter. Shelve the, the confession. Take the case. Oh! <laughs> is that sexual assault? Did he shoot her booty? What did he hit? Oh, that was her hit. Still, if you put a hand there, I'm just saying, skirting around the rules here, Peter. Uh-oh. Tonight's the night. Tonight's the night. Tonight's the night he finds the, the uncle killer. Oh, my God. Oh, no. This is the Dr. Connors plot line. Go and find out what's going on. Oh, uh, this man is so screwed. <laughs> he was so screwed. Oh, my. Hey, you know what? You know, can I say something? I was like passively interested for the first like 30 minutes. I'm like, hey, let's crack some jokes. Let's have, let's have fun. But I was like, I was like, eh, I, I take it or leave it type thing. Ever since the basketball scene, <laughs> everything after that has been a lot of fun. I mean, my kid is drunk. Your kid's fine. No! Hey, look. Just a normal guy, right? Now you gotta kill the kid. Oh, behind you, behind you. Oh, that's such a good shot to get attacked from behind. Uh... Who's pissing? Did the kid piss himself? What was that? Oh my god, the kid's pissed! Let the car on fire! <laughs> Jack, climb now! I can't! Yes, you can! I say let the kid go, man. The mask, it's gonna make you strong. 
That's it, buddy. That's it. Okay, now close. Yeah. I was saying, you could have did that the whole time. Who are you? Spider-Man. It's hitting him now. With great responsibility comes great territory. It's so beautiful. Ew. Oh, it makes sense now. She liked that she was his desktop. She liked that she that he stalked her. Cause she likes spiders. I know she I knew she was weird. Girls who like spiders, 100 percent if they find out a guy that's like moderately attractive is stalking them, they're turned on. 100 percent of the time. Anytime you see a girl with a spider tattoo, just like know this about that. He got lucky though, telling her. Like she's trustworthy. If they broke up and she's just like a teenager, I feel like she would spread the gossip everywhere. Like, oh my god, I just dated Spider-Man. You know, I don't know. Especially if he did something to piss her off. He's lucky. Does he have like the men in black like memory eraser? He jumped to the top of a subway and then like beat the hell out of like four people and there were two onlookers. And now he just caught a football and then threw it so hard that it, it, it bent the metal. And then they cut away like, oh, I guess, I guess. Ooh. And also the way he dumped before, <laughs> he caught too much hang time. What are these people thinking in their heads? They're like, wow, that was crazy. Well, looks like I got math after this. I should get to get the class. At the very least, you just saw like the greatest athletic talent of your life. How does that not like sit in your brain for a while? You know who it is. Dr. Curtis Connors? Dr. Curtis Connors who's also my daughter's mentor. You know, recently Dr. Connors gave Gwen a glowing college recommendation. It was beautiful. <laughs> of course, he can't be a criminal. He gave my daughter a recommendation to college. So he, he couldn't have committed a crime. That's my police brain at work. He has transformed himself into a giant lizard. Let me ask you a question. Do I look like the mayor of Tokyo? Oh, Godzilla. Eh, okay. It's an okay joke. You're gonna go back to hanging out with the citizens of Tokyo? You went back to it, huh? Then again, I've done callbacks to jokes that never even worked in the first place myself. So, you know what? I, I don't really have a lot of room to talk. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna leave that one alone. Hello, lizard! <laughs> Okay, I just want to I just want to explain why I'm laughing. We just watched a human lizard come up out of a toilet, out of a hole where a toilet used to be rather, and out of the bathroom of a high school to beat up a high school kid. And now that he's thrown him around through multiple classrooms, he's now in the science lab concocting potions that are little bombs <laughs> to throw at, to throw at the high schooler. That's just funny. Look at that shit. That's funny. Have to Damn, Peter is getting his at oh wow, she a ride or die. I'm gonna throw you out the window now. <laughs> Imagine if he was out of webbing. <laughs> Somebody's been a bad lizard. Peter has not gotten a single good shot in on the lizard. That's a very trash talk thing to say when you are just getting pummeled. Stan! I spent my life as a How nice is that, Disney? He can just hit the space bar and it plays. Without any trouble, imagine a video player that when you hit the space bar, 100% of the time, it would just play. That seems very convenient. If only we had the technology. Ooh, that first bullet did some damage. And now he's getting lit up. If that didn't kill him, his skin is just too tough. Oh my god, don't stop firing. There's the machine. I told you that was the final the villain machine. Hi, I'm an Oscar. You have to get out of there right now, okay? The antidote is cooking. You leave right now. And this, that is an order, okay? She'll be fine. There's a sequel. She's in that one. I don't think she makes it through that one, but at least she gets to the second one. <laughs> one of them's gonna hit. One of them's gonna hit. <laughs> Gwen Stacy's father. Is he gonna be captured? Gwen Stacy's father sees him and then he's like oh you are on my side because you're banging my daughter <laughs> i can trust you and then he lets him loose also kind of crazy you have a giant lizard who's just released biochemical weapons in the city and you're like we got to take care of that spider fella who's been fighting crime it's like pr priorities maybe oh Freeze. he is gonna find out 
Hey, your daughter's in danger, my guy. And your daughter's there right now. You know, wait, wait, wait. You know what I just realized? He never caught the guy that killed Uncle Ben. Did it finally occur to him that he got free milk out of that? And he's like, okay, well, you know what? I guess it is even kind of even Stevens. <laughs> One minute. <laughs> we got a running clock. Hey, way to add tension. We can chill with some of these effects, yeah. Guys. Antidote complete. Oh, damn, clumsy bitch. Oh, man. He looks injured, and it's really not clear if he's gonna make it. Gotta save my boy on the bridge. Still friends with Matthews, that crane operator down to 6th Avenue? Yeah, I mean, who the hell cares? <laughs> like, they know you're not gonna remember the face. So I love that they added this. That's the guy who saved my boy on the bridge. That's the guy who saved my boy on the bridge. <laughs> As if you would confuse him for someone else. You're watching a, a man in a latex suit climbing up. A wall, just bare hands, and you're like, wait, that's the guy. That's him. Or is it someone else? No, that's him. <laughs> so friends with Matthews, that crane operator down to 6th Avenue? Yeah. All right, so now it's Spider-Man and a crane versus Lizard Man. Injured Spider-Man, though. Is the crane going to be enough to make up for it? We'll have to find out. Oh, that's epic as hell. With the music? Dad. Does the dad die? I was thinking like maybe he dies because he's got he has the truth now. He knows Peter. He's making sure he's okay. Detonation in T minus two minutes. Oh, we're doing another running clock, huh? <laughs> hey, I mean if it works, it works. All alone. He's not alone. Hey, that. Cop dad knows his stuff. Hey, if I shoot the liquid nitrogen pipe based on its angle, it'll whip around right into Spider-Man's hand and make it. Can... No, how? How? I got this, Peter. Go. Oh, you're gonna die, right? Oh, he don't got his web shooters. Oh, he in trouble. Slide, is he gonna slide off the edge almost? And then he's gonna get himself last second? There it is, there it is, <laughs> of course. Boss gonna kill some people for sure. I guess if it's evacuated. Oh. <laughs> Peter, you still have your spider powers. You can stick to the side of the thing. Oh, no. Goodbye, hand. <sighs> he ain't going anywhere. You're gonna make enemies. People will get hurt. Oh, is he gonna say, stay away from my daughter? Sometimes the people closest to you. Oh, stay away from my daughter. So I want you to promise me something. Stay away from my daughter. Leave. Daughter. Gwen, out of it. How do you deny a man his dying wish? He's like, sorry, but like, her lips are so warm and nice. I can't do it, dude. <laughs> oh. Ay, ay, ay. And then she dies anyways. <laughs> Tough, man. He really did damage to this family, huh? Oh my god. Peter's mom and dad. His uncle, his girlfriend's dad, eventually his girlfriend. Hi, yay, yay, Pete. Oh. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> Damn, these New York streets are dangerous. Just one little quip. One little quip, my guy. No? Ah, alright. Oh, Gwen's gotta be a mess. Your boss is a supervillain, kills your father, and your boyfriend's like, hey, sorry. Can't beat with ya. I think if, uh, when she thinks back on this week, she's gonna be like, damn, if I was grading this week, it would be an easy F. <laughs> oh, he gotta break up with her too. <laughs> oh, no. Where have you been? Where have you been? My dad, you go sit her dog? <laughs> oh, that's tough. You could be with her for like a week. Her dad dies and you ghost her immediately? Homie, if I was her and she revealed Sp your secret, Spider-Man's secret, I would understand. She risks her life to help save the city with you. Her father dies in the process and you're like, oh, okay, I'm good. You could have been there with her for like a couple weeks and then broke it off. It didn't have to be immediate, my guy. My father died. I'm saying. It was a funeral. Yeah. Everyone was there but you. No, Gwen, I was there. I was just creeping around the side of a building. <laughs> Don't touch your cheeks, just softly. Like, you, you could have waited a week, my guy. Why did you have to do this immediately? Oh my god, he's too honorable. Can't do this. Can't do this. What are you talking about? 
talking about? What are you saying? What do you think? I can't see you anymore. Why not, Peter? Well, this is an easy F week for me. <laughs> you made you promise, didn't me. Oh, nice. I knew you were smart. She figured it out. Now I know how she gets so many easy A's. <laughs> Fuck. I gotta stop. What a pretty girl. Yeah, she's my screensaver. I'm just no good for her. Peter Parker. If there's one thing you are, it's good. At the beginning, when uh when the father was leaving, I was I was talking about how he didn't really say much to the son, and I was making jokes at the time. I still did register that his his last words to his son were "be good." Be good. Which is just like a quick phrase to be like, hey, uh, be on your best behavior when I leave you in the care of someone else. When you do think about it, it's like his last comments were "be good" and Peter, whether or not he's good, if he does damage to people's lives, and Aunt May's like, hey, you're a good person. That all does connect, you know. And it, that it's not something that like escapes me. Mr. Parker, hardy again. Sorry, Miss Ritter, won't happen again. I promise. Don't make promises you can't keep, Mr. Parker. Yeah, but those are the best kind. Oh, look at that. That's cute as hell. Hey, you know what? I can absolutely see why this is everyone's favorite Spider-Man. Not everyone, but like a lot of people's favorite Spider-Man. This is really fun. What an enjoyable experience. I hope you guys enjoy this commentary. <laughs> Leave a hit the like button. I do appreciate you guys watching. Thank you so much for tuning in. And I'll see you here next Monday. All right. <laughs> see ya. Toodles.